The Milk Tea Lab's South San Jose shop is popular, not only with customers, but apparently with thieves as well. First in January 2021, another one month later, another two months later, another eight months later, and a fifth break-in this past weekend. Owner Wei, who asked that we not show her face out of fear, says the cost of the break-ins adds up fast, from stolen speakers, technology, and money, to the cost of replacing the glass broken when the thieves visit. Like, that's the fear we're living in every day. Oh my God, they might be back again. And these break-ins are coming at a time that's already stressful for local businesses. On top of pandemic issues, they're facing labor shortages and now inflation. The owner says she called police the first few times, but after it took them a while to even respond following a break-in last March, she now wonders if calling them does any good. You know, in the past year, we've seen uh, response times take a little bit longer, especially when there are critical incidents that are unfolding at the same time in the city. San Jose police say it it took officers about an hour and a half to get to her call last March, saying a slower response is not uncommon when they know the suspect is gone and nobody has been hurt. They say staffing challenges mean they have to prioritize, but also say it's critically important that the community report every crime. The more times that we have calls for service generated at a specific location, it goes back to the squeaky wheel gets the oil kind of formula. Meanwhile, the tea shop is making ends meet and making a plea to the thieves. And I hope that the people who are doing this to us, please just uh, stop targeting us. We are, we're, we're in really, really stressful situation as well. In San Jose, Alyssa Gord, NBC, Bay Area News.